I want to show y'all another lie, right? I want y'all to learn about the real Wakanda real quick, too. All right? So let's learn about them real quick. As you continue your world travels, seeing all sorts of majestic sights and incredible cultures, there's one little island that has been dubbed one of the most difficult and dangerous places to visit on the entire planet. In fact, getting anywhere near this Manhattan-sized island is strictly illegal, but the consequences are much more severe than simply being punished by the law. This island rests deep in the Indian Ocean, and the government of India won't allow you to get within three miles of it. Filled with thick forests, the indigenous people of North Sentinel Island are the reason you aren't allowed to ever visit this place. Just listen. Not to protect them from you, however, is to protect you from them, for the most part at least. In 2006, a couple of fishermen washed up on the island and were promptly killed by the inhabitants. But your presence also poses some major risks to their safety. The reason that contact with outsiders can be so dangerous is because they've been in seclusion on their own island untouched for tens of thousands of years. So they likely haven't developed immunity to many diseases that most other people are able to easily fend off. And it puts them at a great risk of being completely wiped out by something like the common cold. Over the years, there have been attempts to connect with them. However, their reactions were mostly hostile, so the Indian government has now given up and decided to leave them alone. We have no idea what they believe about the outside world, but it's understandable that they would be apprehensive and it's very hard. Hold on, hold on. Look at this. This picture is not written. They want to show you little white people in the village. Okay, whatever. Let's let them keep talking, though. In their long history in that location that not all of their visitors have been friendly or had the best intentions. With tourism starting to grow on nearby islands, there are concerns that this could have a negative impact on the people of North Sentinel Island. All right. Enough of the lies. Let's get to about that. So, now, on GNN tonight, we talk about the North Sentinel Island, whatever they want to rename it. But this is one of the Wakandas. We have many of them. But when I told y'all Wakanda was named after, it was made about these different places that we have all over the planet where our people have secluded themselves in, advanced versions of us. Right? Think about it. You know what I'm saying? When they need to zoom in, fuck out of here. Listen. I want y'all to think about something. They telling y'all in the video that the reason, that the fucking reason, the fucking reason that, nigga, we go to that island with carbon, nigga, they gonna embrace your ass, nigga. Them fucking portals gonna open up and they gonna let your ass in and you're gonna see all type of cities right there that you didn't even know was right there because we have that type of advanced technology, right? So notice how they try to trick you away from the island. They land in your skin and you try to step foot on that, on that ancestor property, Yes, you will get y'all ass killed. No carbonated being they gonna touch unless that carbonated being comes on that island on some bullshit. Trying to be an international house Negro. You know, like they when they got to the north, when they got to that island, all of a sudden they now all of a sudden they human. I mean now all of a sudden they care. Oh, we just gonna leave them alone. We you know we wanna respect their culture. We don't want you know. Well, why you didn't do that with all these other islands when you came to They tried them folks and got their ass handed to them and they like, we not fucking with them. They got that shit. They got that real magic that we even we ain't even touched yet. And to keep you away from it, they make little YouTube videos like that. Yeah, it get deep. Just like just like the the Kemet, the people of Kemet still exist. They are just on a higher frequency, so they appear not to exist. Cause y'all not tapped in like that. See, that shit is only in our DNA. Y'all don't know that type of shit. I just gave y'all some shit y'all ain't even know. You feel me? Why y'all goofy ass all over there in Egypt, all in the sand and shit? Looking for shit, trying to talk about hey, the Comet was an old ancient civil. No, nigga, Comet still exists. They just on a higher frequency that you can't see because the higher you move up in frequency, the it vibrates so fast that you can't see it with these two eyes. And y'all ain't got y'all pineal glands unlocked. On top of that, y'all have no access into ancient Timbuktu or ancient Comet because my ancestors, our ancestors, know you bitches ain't shit. Fuck you mean? Unlike Wakanda, y'all will never get in Timbuktu or y'all will never get in Comet. They both still exist, nigga. Fuck you talking about? They both still here, nigga. They both still where y'all think they ain't. Y'all just can't see it. Fuck out of here, nigga. Feel me? They still exist. How about how, how about those metaphysical apples for your ass? Goofies. Straight goofies. They have to be thinking they know some shit. They have to be all over there in Egypt, all under the sand. Trying to find out about us, nigga. They don't even know how to use it. And, and come to find out, damn. We still can't use it without the fucking key, and we are the fucking key. You can't use our none of our shit without us.
Still don't work. It has to listen. In order for let me help the elites out. Cause I know the people that's listening, they probably know what y'all probably know. what the fuck the the oppressors who listen to know what I'm talking about. They've been trying to find out how to get to ancient Timbuktu and ancient Kemet for a long time now. They kind of figure it's still there, but they don't know for sure. It's like that type of thing, right? And the only thing that's left from ancient Kemet down here is the pyramids of Egypt that's in a material form. So the only reason that that, that what we basically did, what our ancestors did was those that stay in ancient Kemet and Timbuktu, they slowed the vibration down. When they they sped it, when the, when, the, when the war took place, Certain cities within Atlantis hid themselves so that they would never be found because they killed so many of us. You know what I'm saying? So certain cities within us was, was like using spells to hide themselves. So our ancestors wanted to leave codes and messages behind for those who got locked outside of Timbuktu and ancient Kemet. So what they did was slow down the frequency and the vibration of certain pyramids in ancient Kemet so that it would still appear on this realm. Meanwhile, they on a higher frequency up from up above looking down because everything goes up, not down. This is the lowest ram right here. That's why everything is a solid. Solids vibrate slow. That's basic physics. Solids, liquids, gas, plasma, energy. The higher you go up, the faster the vibration of the atoms within those things. You get what I'm saying? This is metaphysics. That's why y'all bitches be mad at me because y'all know I, I, I know what the fuck is going on. Y'all know y'all don't know where it's at. I know where it's at. Yeah, and I'm not gonna never say it on, on live like that. Certain things I just won't say to protect our species. But I know exactly where the ancestors, certain ancestors that's still in our ancient cities of Timbuktu and ancient Kemet that y'all think no longer exist are located at on this planet. So at the end of the day, on this realm, rather, you know what I'm saying? So that's what that's that's what I'm talking about, y'all. You feel me? Ain't finna let our black ass go deep down into the pyramids, boy. Cause we got just just on us, like just like these tattoos on my on me, in your energetic field, in your electromagnetic field, you harness certain code, certain code encryptions. You have encryptions written in your in your in your arteries. You have encryptions written in your heartbeat. The way your heartbeat is an encryption. Do, 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 do. That opens certain gateways if you go to certain locations, man. You hear me deeply. Everything about you and within you. Is set up to unlock all type of shit on the planet. So that's why they don't let us go up in there. You ain't got to try to open shit. You will walk down the tunnel, nigga, and that shit is going to start opening. Shit that they've been trying to open for, like when they see it, it's just a whole wall with all these little inscriptions. And they out there all night just studying hieroglyphics and trying to figure out how to open the wall and keeping the shit a secret from us. But let you tell if they take your black ass right there, nigga, that motherfucker, as soon as you get in front of the wall, because the encryptions is in you. That motherfucker gonna open up. Yeah, you gonna walk clean through. They know it. See what I'm saying? Hollywood, they like to, they literally take people and they go take them to these pyramids and low at certain places they didn't hear from the public and they try to use their vessel to open shit up and it don't work. Or if they do open shit up, they get fucked up behind it. And that's what they were showing you in Lovecraft Country. When they use his vessel with the black guy at the end to try to open a portal and they got fucked up. Cause they can't handle the power of the different frequencies of other of, of, of the realm. They are single cell organisms. And the reptilians who are the fallen guys, they can't take it because they only belong back up in the asteroids because of what they did. Their vibration will never be able to ascend again. This shit run deep. The rabbit hole run real deep. Okay? So you got to understand that and overstand that that's why, what the pyramids is there for, just for that. But ancient command still in full throbbing. Tim, the University of Timbuktu, which is one of the few schools they will even mention, but don't get that deep about it. Like, yeah, we had a lot of that. We had all that. We had so many that they destroyed. They got all our books, all our stuff. They got it all. They know what we knew. You know what I'm saying? They know what we was doing to do that. Black Panther was all about all these ancient civilizations that we still have right here on this planet on this realm of Atlantis that is in full throttle but they can't see them because they vibrating too high so they shielded they self they cloaked they self from them that's what what that's what black that's what Wakanda represents those civilizations